Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. The topic is splenomegaly. In the previous video, I explained the signs and symptoms, the location of the spleen and its functions, you know. But today's topic is what are the causes of the splenomegaly or what are the causes of enlarged spleen, you know. Uh, but before starting, I would like to request you uh, to subscribe this channel for more informative videos every day. Thank you. You know, the causes of enlarged spleen are like uh, blood disorders, or uh, decreased blood flow, and uh, cancers, and uh, metabolic diseases, infections, and trauma. You know. Uh, the first thing is uh, blood disorders. You know, the spleen will enlarge uh, if uh, uh, it when. Uh, it performs more of its duties to filter blood or to manufacture blood cells, you know. And uh, uh, any disease or any condition that damage the red blood cells and requires them to be filtered and removed from the bloodstream will cause the spleens to become larger. And the conditions such as the uh, hemolytic anemia uh, where the red blood cells are damaged and broken down uh, can cause the spleen to enlarge and uh, uh, mishappen uh, red blood cells like uh, those found in the sickle cell disease or thalassemia and uh, 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 spherocytosis, you know, um, may be damaged when they try to squeeze through the small capillary blood vessels, you know. And these damaged red blood cells need to be coiled from the bloodstream and are filtered out by the spleen, you know. So as a result, the enlargement of the spleen happens, you know. The next uh, uh, cause is a decreased blood flow, you know. So as you know, the spleen will enlarge if there is a decrease in blood flow through the splenic vein, you know. And uh, this may cause the spleen congestion and enlargement. and. Uh, and this situation may be associated with the liver disease and uh, portal hypertension, you know. And the damage to the liver cells makes it difficult for the blood to flow normally. And uh, uh, as the blood uh, backs up in the portal vein system, uh, it may also affect the pressure in the splenic vein, you know. So the decreased ability of the blood to drain from spleen causes uh, to become congested and grow larger, you know. And the people with the congestive heart failure may have enlarged liver and the spleen because of uh, the poor blood flow to and from the heart. The next cause is the cancer. You know, you know leukemia and uh, lymphoma uh, may be associated with uh, abnormal white blood cells and that can uh, uh, invade the spleen and increase its sizes, you know. And uh, the other types of cancers like uh, uh, cancers that can spread or uh, uh, metastasize, you know, to the spleen and cause it to enlarge, you know. And the next uh, cause is the metabolic, disorder, met metabolic disorders or metabolic diseases, you know. And, uh, you know, the certain uh, metabolic diseases may cause the spleen to enlarge and uh, including the Harler syndrome, uh, Gaucher disease, and uh, uh, Neumann Pick disease, you know. So these are the metabolic diseases which can cause the spleen to enlarge, you know. And in sarcoidosis uh, and uh, amyloidosis, uh, you know, and the spleen can be involved and become enlarged with the abnormal protein deposits, you know. So these are the metabolic uh, causes, you know. The next thing is infection, which is another cause of the uh, spleen enlargement, you know. Uh, you know, some infections uh, may cause uh, splenomegaly or the enlargement of spleen, you know, and they include like uh, uh, infectious uh, mononucleosis, you know, uh, or uh, cytomegalovirus, uh, HIV and AIDS, uh, viral hepatitis, malaria, uh, tuberculosis, and 
uh, anaplasmosis, you know. So these are the infectious diseases which can cause the spleen to enlarge and the spleen megaly, you know. And uh, the finally, there's another uh, cause of the spleen enlargement is trauma, you know, or injury to the spleen, you know. Uh, like from a car accident or uh, it can damage to the spleen, you know, or any other falls or any other accidental damage to the spleen, you know. So it can cause the spleen to enlarge. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video. The next video will be about the diagnosis of the splenomegaly or the enlarged spleen. You know. uh, thank you very much and please do not forget to like, subscribe and share this video. Goodbye.